heroes for saving their teacher who had a medical emergency in class. This happened in Alabama. The teacher says all of a sudden she just wasn't feeling well. A student asked if she was okay. She asked him to go get help. Turns out she was having a seizure. Her students didn't hesitate or panic. They got help and she was able to get to the emergency room. Local law enforcement, along with the superintendent, honored the kids with certificates and medals. Well deserved. Heroes. All right, temperatures right now sitting at 74. I think that's probably where we top out today. We're going to start to see some cooler weather as we head into the afternoon and evening. 33 by tomorrow morning. Wind chill values will be in the 20s. A very different day tomorrow. Breezy, uh, close to 60 for a high. And then, then we moderate some over the weekend. Next week looks fairly busy. Some chances for storms. And we've got another strong cold front, it looks like, by the middle part of next week. We'll keep you posted. All right, Justin, thank you. And thank you for watching the yeah. News at Noon. Thanks for joining us. SA Live starts right now. Today on SA Live, enjoy rodeo season with a vaquero chili recipe from a renowned pit master, Adrian Dadala. Plus, this lasso and dance team has been around since 1932, and now they're preparing for their biggest event of the year, and we get a special performance. And Cherry Pie Day, Muffin Day, and Banana Cream Pie Day are all on their way. We show you the local bakery that it has it all and more. Celebrate San Antonio. Coming to you live from historic Market Square. This is SA Live. We're the Thomas Jefferson High School Lassos, and you're, you're watching, watching SA Live. <laughs> oh, hello, and happy Thursday. Well, we will see a bit more from the Jefferson Lassos a little bit later. I always love it when they come here to Foreign Force. It's been a couple of years. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Mike Osterhage. And I'm Fiona Gorostizo. Well, the Sweat SA event is an opportunity to see the best of what San Antonio has to offer in the health and fitness space all under one roof. And here to tell us all about it is Sweat Spokesperson and Joyride Instructor, my wife Bonnie Osterhage and Kelly Middleton, Joyride Instructor. Good afternoon, ladies. Hi. So Hi. what is Sweat all about? So Sweat is like a little smorgasbord, like a little buffet of fitness and wellness and health. Anything that has to do with that, you're going to find it here. So you're going to be able to take little mini classes from some of the best studios in town, including us, Smart bar, uh, Leha's Boxing, we've got YMCA, gyms, fitness boutiques all coming together. There's going to be snacks from La Quintera, some healthy bites, there's going to be a healthy happy hour, shopping with all these local vendors that are in the health and wellness space. It's just something for everybody. You can sweat, you can shop, you can snack, and do it all over again. So if, say, you, uh, there, let me start over. <laughs> <laughs> You're selling me now. Right? So if someone hasn't worked out at all right. and they don't know what kind of workout would work for them, right. this is kind of the perfect event to go to, this right? This is what sweat is all about. Yeah, because there is not workouts are not one size fits all, right? right? We want to be as healthy as possible. So you want to find the workout that works for you. This is the best way to do that. It's like speed dating, right? You go try a little 15 minute class here, 15 there, 15 there. Check it all out. Find what works for you. You might find more than one that you love and then you go check them out at their studios. So Joyride is a proud sponsor this year. I'm super excited about that because it's the first time you're actually gonna have the option to take an indoor cycle class at La Quintera. So Kelly, you're gonna have bikes all set up there and, and run classes, That's right? That's exactly right. We have three instructors that are slotted to teach four 30-minute classes. So you're gonna get a little taste of our traditional 50-minute class. I promise it's gonna be high intensity, awesome music, great instructors. Um, you know, our, our instructors focus so much on their playlists and curate the music and ride on the beat. And so it's gonna be a great time. Um, it's also a great opportunity if you're feeling a little intimidated about coming to a class. Um, you can talk to the instructors, you know, do a little sampling, and you're not in for the full commitment at the studio. So somebody can basically just sort of browse, if you will, and, and again, if they, if they want to find a workout program because um, cycling may not be perfect for somebody or jogging may not be perfect for somebody, and y'all can instruct them on that, yep, right? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. And so there's also going to be some really good lectures going on as well with nutritionists, health and wellness coaches, and people talking about... Um, just kind of how to move, how to eat, and how to find what works for you. Everybody is an individual, right? It is not one size fits all. Now you, Bonnie, have participated in this event since its inception as a coach, right? So why is Sweat Essay so important? So one of the things I love about Sweat is I think San Antonio gets a really bad rap, right? As far as we've been billed as the most obese city, we are, you know, not kind of up there with some other cities in terms of a lot of 
outdoor things to do, and we're changing that, right? So we've got these great, awesome hike and bike trails now. We have Ciclovia, we have Sweat, we have fitness studios on lots of corners now. We have good, healthy restaurants. So Sweat is just there to bring people together, to show people what we have to offer. And in today's world, staying healthy, building a strong immune system, that's what it's all about. So we're gonna show you how to do that and where you can find everything you need in San Antonio. So if somebody wants to come there in workout clothes to work out or just come there and go, well, can you tell me a little bit about Joyride or tell me a little bit about this? And that's what they can do, right? Sure. Absolutely, yeah, absolutely. Okay. Okay. And the hours for it? And so the hours are gonna be from uh, nine to one. It's at La Cantera Resort and Spa. Tickets are $15. You can enter code SI Live at checkout for $5 off. Joyride classes, you can actually book your spot online or when you're there, you can come find us at our, at our booth and sign up. Okay. And now, I know cycling has become really, really popular with folks, but again, a lot of people might think, well, I haven't been on a bike since I was a little kid, but you can just sit in the back and pedal like you're on a trike if you want to. Absolutely, just to get yeah. I mean, we, we have clients that are seasoned athletes all the way to people that have never done this before and are intimidated. So I want to just reiterate, it's a very non-intimidating environment. We welcome all ages, all levels, and um, I promise it'll be a really fun time, easy on the joints, yeah. and uh, you'll get lots to joy okay. so come see us okay. all right now where can folks go for more information on joyride so joyride is joyridestudio.com yep. and that's where you can find more information about both of our san antonio locations we have one at the alon center and we have one down on broadway right. and also you can go to our website find out more information about sweat to sign up there to get the the discount five dollars off those fifteen dollar tickets so click on the uh, as seen on sa live tab or just snap that uh, QR code there in the uh, bottom left hand side of your screen. Ladies, thank you very much. I appreciate it. Thank you. All right, rodeo. Mm -hmm. And not only is that all the rodeo activities, but the concerts, that's a big part of it. People love it. and it, it's wide ranging. Yes, so our question of the day is age yourself by telling us the first concert you went to. Go. Kiss. You too. Kiss. Right. Oh, you said yeah. you too. Oh gosh, okay, so let And then, and then got to meet Gene Simmons and Paul Stanley. That was even cool, remember? That was cool for you, yeah. So what about y'all? <laughs> so First let us know at SA Live KSAT on Facebook and Twitter, and you may see your answer a little later in the show. What was your first concert, honey? Mine? Yeah. Kenny Rogers when I was like six. <laughs> New kids. New kids on the block. There we go. All right. Okay, after you work out, it is time for a piece of pie. This was the most disappointing thing when I learned that they were not going to be on the show, but Jen was going to be out there live. <laughs> yes, our Jen Tobias Dresky is checking out the menu. How's it tasting, Jen? Yes, there's so many dessert themed holidays coming up and you know SA Live, we love to celebrate that every time. So we're here at Tootie Pie here in Bernie. I have Brian Dembski joining me now and you're talking about one of the favorites, the M Pie Nada. Look at that. Doesn't that look delicious? And this is one of the favorites, right? Yes, absolutely. We introduced the Empire Nadas uh, June last year and they took off and became a huge hit because now you can get your, your pie and eat it in the car, eat it on the go. It's perfect. <laughs> Who doesn't love that, So right? in um, <laughs> honor of Cherry Pie Day, I have Jen here and she's actually going to help me make my famous cherry empanada. Mm, yes. All right. All so right. what's the first step? Well, first we start with our delicious red tart cherries and then we add our secret butter magic. Butter magic. Can't say everything that's in here, right? Yes. <laughs> no, I cannot. I added special seasonings to it to make it even better. And then go ahead and pour in our sugar mixture and it's got a little magic dust as well. Ooh, yeah. That's going to help keep it together. All right. And what you want to do is go ahead and mix this up real good. And Cherry Pie Day, that is the 20th, I believe, right? Yes, right? Cherry Pie Day is coming up on the 20th. And um, so mm. in, we're going to have Cherry Pie. We have our big 11-inch Cherry Pie, our 8-inch Cherry Pie. We also do a lower sugar Cherry Pie, which I believe my wife will be showing you that a little bit later today as well. And I love that about Tootie Pie because they have all kinds of different options, uh, mm -hmm. maybe for those watching the sugar like you mentioned. Exactly. And if you're gluten-free, we can actually make you a gluten-free Cherry Pie. Um, but we would need at least 10 days notice and it'd be a special order, but it can be done. All right, that's perfect, Jen, okay. right there. Mm -hmm. Now your next step is I have our pre-measured scoop. Okay. You want to scoop that out and put it right right here in our little pie shell, which I've already got pressed out. Now that's a healthy scoop, I like that. that. That's good. <laughs> yeah, I usually level it off, but that's perfect. Okay. Okay. That's good right there? That's perfect. Okay. Now go ahead and it's pick this up <laughs> and press it closed. You this might get a little so bit of filling that comes out, but that's all right. You press real hard. Okay. I might need awesome. to help you. 
<laughs> yeah, you overfilled it a bit, but that's all right. <laughs> that makes it delicious. Oh. All right, now here, I'll help you out a little bit because okay. it gets a little tricky right here, especially with this crust that's extra. Oh, I Normally see. we save this crust and reuse it, but since there's salt filling on it, we're going to go ahead. I guess I'm not hired here there as a you, pie filler. <laughs> you, it's your first time. You did great. This is perfect. So now what we're going to do is we're going to get this in the oven uh -huh. and um, we'll bake it up. And Magic of TV. Here we go. Right here. This is how it looks when it comes out. And then we're not quite done, right? No, we are not done yet because we have to add a very delicious glaze to it. Now the pie is perfect like it is, but we add this icing that makes it wonderful. Just like that. Go little sideway lines on it. That is absolutely Whoop. perfect. All right. And that is our cherry empanada. Lovely. So I have to take a bite here. But there's so many different flavors that you have with these empanadas. And I guess you're going to show us some over Yes. There. I actually have some here with me today. You've, mm. of course, already saw the cherry, which is absolutely amazing. I think you're trying it now. Mm. We also make a blueberry lemon. That's one of our seasonal flavors. We do an apple. And that's going to be year round as long as our chocolate one. We're also working on some other new flavors. We are going to launch, believe it or not, a boozy selection wow. of empanadas. Because, well, Tootie <laughs> Pie, we love booze. We like to bake with it. Mm -hmm. Now, this location has been here for about a year. We're getting a request to open this open here. So let's let's see one of the, uh, this is the lemon one? The let's lemon one? Absolutely. I'll be happy to break this open yeah. for you. Ooh. And look at that. Now this is a blueberry with lemon in it, and also we do a lemon drizzle on top as opposed to a regular icing. This one's been very popular. I have one customer, since it's seasonal, she calls me once a month, all year round, says, can you please make this for me? <laughs> I know you said it's seasonal, but we do it because we love our customers and we're gonna make them happy. Mm -hmm. And another favorite, because I know the weather's kind of silly here right now, but you mentioned when it gets really cold, you also have some savory pies. So the pot pie is one of the favorites, right? Yes, we have a chicken pot pie that is to die for. Um, <laughs> it is so good. Um, um, I can eat almost the whole thing, but it does serve four, and we also do quiches. Mm -hmm. Yes, and somebody just came in earlier to get that, so breakfast quiches, uh, different kinds, and then um, we also are going to, a little later in the show, talk about your other pies, because there's just so much, right, that you guys have been going on about a year now. So yes, you were here about a year ago yeah. for our grand opening, and I'm so glad you're back to show off some of the new items we're carrying, mm -hmm. and I believe uh, you're going to be seeing Jamie later talking about some of the newer items as well. Perfect. All right. Well, we will tease ahead to that because we are going to top off a banana cream pie. And of course, there's such a huge selection anytime you come here to Tutti Pie to choose from. They also do custom cakes if you have a request, maybe a birthday, an anniversary, special occasion, um, or just, you know, get that six pound apple pie. We know that's a favorite. So, so many options when you come out here to Tutti Pie. I think I'm going to take another bite of this, guys. I am sorry that you can't have this. I'll try to send some back, okay? Uh, Never been so jealous of Jenny. Mm -hmm. You're holding on to that hope, aren't you? For more information on Tootie Pie Company, just head to salive.com and click on the As Seen on SA Live tab or just snap that QR code on your screen. All right, still ahead. Get your fill of rodeo season, not just from the shows, but from the food. We share a vaquero chili recipe from Davila's Barbecue that is perfect for the rodeo. Plus, the Thomas Jefferson High School Lassos give us a big performance in a few minutes, so stick around. The world famous Thomas Jefferson High School Lassos were established in 1932. The Lassos caught the eye of the entire nation when they were featured on the cover of Life magazine. And today they can be seen across South Texas in parades, community events, and fundraisers. We get to see a special performance right now.
great job, ladies. Oh, That's yes. wonderful. Yes, and come on down. Joining us right now, of course, is Head Spirit Director Christina Neal. Okay, so how does one become a Jefferson Lasso? Can any girl at the high school join or are there tryouts? Yes, okay, so there are tryouts and it is a district requirement that they do one year in a different organization, whether that's Pep Squad, ROTC, band. We just want to show that they have a year of commitment in a different organization and then they are more than welcome to try out for our team. 1932, yes. I mean, the history behind that Life Magazine cover. What are some of the other the highlights of the, the great history of this organization? Oh my gosh, I feel like 90 years is hard to just hit that many highlights but these girls have performed in front of Eleanor Roosevelt they've had tea with her they've been on life magazine this year for the first time ever they're going to be going to Walt Disney World and so we just have so many things I can't even sum it all up <laughs> so Disney World coming up any other events yes we are going to be competing in Fredericksburg Texas and every high school drill team has like competition so we go and that's kind of like our season right you've got basketball season football season but our contest season is for our time to shine and really show off our skills how does this organization help out these young women and also kind of the role that, that it and they play in the community right so our saying is once a lasso always a lasso these young women learn you know great social skills they do lots of community events we create leaders and we just are creating young women who are going to be global thinkers and learners yeah <laughs> all right where can folks go for more information on the team so you can always visit our team website with thomasjeffersonhighschool.com or if you want to know more about the lassos specifically you can reach our alumni at lasso alumni association.org this is great because we just got to see him a couple of weeks ago in the cattle drive and now, now here on our show yes. thank you all so yes. very much ladies you did a fantastic job <laughs> all right for more information on the thomas jefferson high school lassos just head to salive.com and click on the as seen on sa live tab where we've provided Provided a link or just snap the QR code on your screen. Hey, if you want to rodeo like a cowboy, you gotta eat like one. We share a vaquero chili recipe from Davila's Barbecue. And First Mark Credit Union is supporting local educators. They share some big news next. Welcome back to SA Live. Well, our next guest has a long history supporting educators. It all started with 10 teachers during the Great Depression. That's when they decided to form a credit union to serve educators in San Antonio. And now, First Mark Credit Union is more committed than ever to the success of our schools and all who work hard to impact the lives of local children. They're behind KSAT's Educator of the Month, and here to tell us more is Marissa Perez Diaz, Executive Director of the First Mark Foundation. Welcome, welcome. Thank you, Fiona. It's great to be with you again. Of course. Now, last month you told us about the First Mark Scholarship application through the San Antonio uh, Area Foundation. How can graduating high school seniors apply and what does that process look like? Yeah, that's a great question. Thank you so much. So yes, um, just as I mentioned um, last time I was here, the application closes on February 28th, so we still have time. Members of First Mark Credit Union, anybody that has um, seniors that are about to graduate, please um, visit firstmarkcu.org uh, and under our Give Back tab, you'll find the link for the application. And so um, our, again, app applications close on February 28th. And then um, after that, we'll go through about a month long process of review and hopefully we can announce our winners um, at the end of March or early April. So what initiatives does Firstmark have coming up, you know, to make an impact with members? Yes, so, you know, you, you did a wonderful job sharing our history. We are committed to our school district employees, our, um, our school system employees. And so in order for us to be able to serve in the best way possible, we're actually going to be reaching out to different um, education organizations, our school districts, um, anybody who out, who's out there working in the education space. We're going to call you in. We're going to ask that you join us in focus groups and ask whether or not Firstmark is really serving you in the way that you need. And if not, what can we do to develop products, to develop services that really help you in this time? So how can folks give back? 
Yeah, so, um, you know, I, I shared, um, I think a few times ago when I was here, that we really, we launched a product that really democratizes um, the way in which we, we give back to community. And so, through the power of the dollar checking account, our members give a dollar each month. That dollar goes directly to the foundation. And so, to date, our, um, our members, 7,000 strong uh, so far, have given, um, have given to, this, uh, to this foundation. We've been able to um, fund educator grants to this point, and um, there's going to be a lot more that we can do. But in order for, for us to do that, we really do need your help. So with the current 7,000 members that we have, that um, translates into $84,000 into the, into the uh, foundation to give back to the education community. But imagine what we can do if we had more members. Absolutely. All right, so you can nominate your favorite teacher for KSAT's Educator of the Month and a chance to win a $500 gift card. All you have to do is visit ksat.com slash educator for details. And for more information on First Mark Credit Union, just call 210-442-0100. That's 442-0100. Or visit the website firstmarkcu.org. Marissa, thank you so much. Thank you. Still ahead on SA Live, Jen is still out at the Tootie Pie Company tasting all of their latest treats and Mike is so jealous right now. She'll be sharing their banana cream pie. Banana cream pie, Mike, and more. All right, and Davila's Barbecue shares a yummy chili recipe to warm you up during rodeo season. Welcome back to SA Live. Well, you can get your fill of rodeo season not just from the shows, but from the food. Yes, indeed. And we share a vaquero chili recipe from Davila's Barbecue, renowned pit master Adrian Davila. And I'll tell you what thing, this is perfect for the rodeo. Hi, Adrian Domino here at Domino's Barbecue in Seguin, Texas. It's rodeo time. There's not a dish that represents the cowboy vampiro culture here in South Texas more than chili con carne. Hi, we're making chili for my cookbook, Cowboy Barbecue. The tip from the pit is cold roasted tomatoes to add that smoky flavor to the chili. And we're going to add brisket into the mix for the meat. Okay, we're going to wrap these tomatoes in foil. Straight in the coal for about 20 minutes, get them nice and charred, take them out, and then we're gonna peel them. Okay, this is fresh ground, is what you call the chili grind, which is gonna be a cut thicker than hamburger meat. It's what you need for chili. So this is a mixture of brisket and chuck. You can ask your butcher to cut it fresh for you, don't be afraid of that, and ask him to cut whatever you like, whatever percentage you want of brisket and chuck, you can even have pork, it's all about you. Take that meat, put it into a stock pot, cover it with water just a couple of inches above it, 45 minutes over medium heat, skim it the whole time, and you should be good. The secret to chili is the spices, and we definitely have a bunch of them. All right, here's the Andre chili powder. I've already mixed in the cayenne pepper so it's all together. Onion salt, fresh oregano, Mexican if possible, beef stock, cumin, pepper, salt, garlic. We're gonna add some water to that and mix it all in and make like a slurry. Before you add to the hot liquid, you've got to mix this all in to disperse it evenly. It's what you call a chili slurry. Okay, now we're gonna add that to the cooked meat. That's where all the flavor is at. Okay, those tomatoes have come out, we've peeled them, we're gonna chop them up and then put them into the stock pot. Okay, here's those tomatoes, we've chopped them up, they're going right into the stock pot so they can cook down. All right, those last aromatics, some bay leaf to finish. You can even use a cheesecloth if you don't want the bay leaf in the chili. Okay, here's where it gets real. Here's where the controversy starts. Beans or no beans, it's up to you. At this point, we have pinto beans. You can add cooked pinto beans, kidney beans, whatever you like. It's all up to you. So go beans or no beans. 
Now everything's in the pot. You go about 30 to 40 minutes, let all those flavors come together. And now it's time to decide. Cornbread, pan de campo, flour tortillas, corn tortillas. You really can't go wrong finding something to absorb all that goodness with. Now it's time to dig in. Happy Rodeo, San Antonio. Here, here. Oh, <laughs> no kidding. So, my, I, cornbread. Yeah, cornbread yeah. with butter. Do you like uh, sour cream and chili? Yeah. And some uh, some onions on there too. Uh -huh. Oh goodness gracious! <laughs> I can just uh -huh. smell that right now. <laughs> oh well, of course, for more information on Davila's Barbecue, just head to our website salive.com and click on the as seen on SA Live tab, or just snap the QR code there on your screen. It doesn't really matter. You can film whatever you want. The Nana Cream Pie Day is also coming up, so we're celebrating here at TD Pie. They are launching their banana cream pie today. I think this day is more important then, right? In my opinion, we're going to make this and also give it a try. Stay with us. Welcome back to SA Live. Well, you know, we've been drooling over the display of desserts over there at Tootie Pie Company where Jen is and we've started looking around for any sort of food that I know. we have here. Jen, <laughs> do you realize how painful this is seeing all those wonderful, delicious pies that you have? What's next? I know. I'm sorry. Yeah, <laughs> that's all I can say. Uh, but yes, we're celebrating that earlier. I, I'll rub it in a little bit more, Mike. Uh, we showed you our cherry pie, Empanada. Love the name. But now it's all about celebrating Banana Cream Pie Day. And I have Jamie Dembski, co-owner here at Sweetie Pie and Bernie. And we are going to top off. This is new. This is big. This is brand new. Today they are <laughs> launching this Banana Cream Pie. And who are yes. you partnering with? So we are partnering with Putting It Out There. They have made the filling for this delicious Banana Cream Pie. Mm -hmm. We are so excited to be launching it today on SA Live. Yay! So Jen and I are going to be topping our banana cream pie. So what we're going to do, Jen, is we're going to start and we're going to go in circles like this. Oh, the yeah. most okay. fun thing about whipped cream is that you can always fix it. So thank you for saying that. Even <laughs> no if we, it, it, I it. yeah, <laughs> I'm not the decorator either, Jen. <laughs> but yours looks great. <laughs> <laughs> looking really good too, Jen. <laughs> We're having fun here. So and this is new though, and, and because before you didn't do many cream pies, is that correct? No, this is our first time doing cream pies, mm -hmm. so we are so excited. Our customers have been asking for it, and now we were able to partner with putting it out there to make it a reality. Ooh, all right. And I mean, the whipped cream just adds that special touch, right? Yes, <laughs> it does. And for those who are not aware, putting it out there, yes, they're here in Bernie, and they have all kinds of flavors. And it's so great that you guys do a lot of partnerships with um, businesses around here. Yes. So I'm just going to, you know, it's yep, not the just take thing, it. Yeah, no, mine isn't but either. I guarantee you, it tastes amazing. So it does matters. taste amazing, and so it doesn't really matter what it looks like. Look Jen, she's a professional over there. She's going better than I am. <laughs> so we'll finish that one off and then we're going to scoot down because there's so much more. Now, what I love about all these holidays is that we can celebrate them by indulging a bit, right? Yes. So, so while I take a bite, such a tough task. Again, sorry, Mike and Fiona. So while I take a bite here, let's talk about, we mentioned Cherry Pie Day, but you guys have a low sugar option. With yes, this. we have a lower sugar cherry option that you can come into the store. We have different sizes, eight inch and 11 inch. We also have a lower sugar blueberry, a lower sugar apple, a lower sugar peach, and then a lower sugar that's four, right? Apple. There we go. <laughs> Apple. I had to look back there and just yeah. double check. Good to know. Great yes. options. But yes. you also told me that along with Cherry Pie Day, they share the holiday. I told you we were yes. with these sweet holidays with Muffin Day. Yes. <laughs> um, we had actually launched these muffins on SA Live before um, when we first opened. But these are even better now. We've made them more of a 2D staple. They are doubled in size, but not doubled in cost. Ooh, so nice. we have our blueberry, and we have our famous crumb topping on top, mm -hmm. and then we have our banana nut. I feel like we made this one last time. Yes, Didn't we made. We? Yes, we oh, made the blueberry one. Can't forget. I that. don't know if we made banana <laughs> nut, but I remember we made blueberry and we topped it. And Texas size. You yes, love Texas that. size. Speaking of Texas size. Yes, speaking of Texas size, <laughs> we have. Salad. Yes, we have our apple here. This is our famous huge apple pie. <laughs> it's six pounds of deliciousness, and it is the most popular item that we sell. We also ship 
these across the nation and they make great gifts. Great gifts. So you can Good send these to your family or friends or mm -hmm. even your business partners or clients. Yes. They make great gifts. I love that about 2D Pie that you can, can ship them yes. and people have the option. If you can't make it out here to Bernie. Now we talk about all these different holidays but we also have St. Patty's Day coming up and you yes. have a pie over there that's inspired by that. So we have our Irish whiskey cheesecake right here. It's made with Jameson Irish whiskey and topped with our beautiful whipped cream topping there. Okay, rewind. It's made with whiskey. Is yes. That right? Did yes. I that right? okay. yes. It's so actually made with whiskey. <laughs> yes. Uh -huh. oh, that's amazing. <laughs> so fitting for the holiday. Yes, hey, it we're makes not it perfect. Done, we're still not done because no. what about Pie Day on the 14th of March? What yes. Do you guys play off of that, right? Yes, we do. <laughs> so it may be a math thing, but we make it a pie thing. Of course. So um, you can come by our Bernie location or our Dripping Springs location as well, and you can get slightly for three dollars and fourteen cents all day that day. Okay, that's well, you said three dollars and fourteen. Cents? Yes, three dollars and fourteen cents slices for pie day. Got it. And so many number, like so many top sellers when you come here. So yes. you can just come in. Uh, get, what are your hours for those watching? So we are open Monday through Friday from nine a.m. to seven p.m. And then Saturday we're open eleven to five, and we are actually closed on Sundays now. So that's something new that started. And when we get closer to the holidays, we will be open on Sundays too. All right, well, I'm gonna take a little bite here of the Irish, what was it called again? Irish whiskey cheesecake. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Is mm -hmm. it good, Jen? Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's again, one of I our favorites. I don't to rub it in, Mike and Fiona, but they have quite the boozy selection as well. You can get a flight of um, different pies, just so many options. I'm on a sugar high right now. <laughs> so this is so delicious. Again, Mike, Fiona, I'm hey. so. Jen, oh, I'm so we sorry. found a, we found a small bag of caramel corn stuffed in a drawer somewhere, so we're eating that right now. So, oh my yeah. yeah. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> Enjoy. Oh, oh yes, I just want to reach right through. For more information on Tutti Pie Company, just head to our website, salive.com, and click on the ad scene on SA Live tab, or just snap that QR code on your screen. That was I'm like one of those infomercials. How much did you pay? Don't answer, because we've got another pie, and another pie, and another pie. I'm going with. Got mm -hmm. caramel corn. And next, one of the greatest gifts you can give yourself is a boost of confidence. How a local doctor can give you the smile you've always wanted. It's straight ahead on SA Live. Well, do you think your dental issues are untreatable? Maybe you've gone from doctor to doctor only to find yourself back again months later dealing with another issue. Well, there is a permanent solution and we know it can help. The team from Stone Ridge Dental, Dr. Alfonso Menares and his wife, Yesenia, are here to tell us about the All On For procedure. Welcome, welcome. Thanks, Thanks for having us, Kim. All right, Dr. Menares, what's special about the All On For procedure and why does it work for almost all patients dealing with dental issues? Fiona, you know, there's lots of patients that it, it breaks my heart. They spend a lot of time and money in the dental chair, right? And like you said, they, they have a lot of dental issues. They go to the dentist and it never ends. So some of them are genetically predisposed to have very weak teeth that, that are lost very early in life. They all own four replaces teeth. While we cannot change a person's genetic predisposition, we can put a new set of teeth in their mouth with dental implants in one day while they're sleeping. That looks beautiful, it gives them optimal function, great health, and they will never have a cavity again. They will never need a filling or a root canal, and, and it's really life-changing. Uh, that's why we call it a permanent solution for and it puts an end to all the problems. Well, of course, and you know, you're, you're saving them time, you're saving them money in the future because it's incredibly frustrating to have to keep going back for yet another issue. And Yesenia, you're giving hope to a lot of people out there. So once they come in for a consultation, the process is painless and easy, right? It is a very sophisticated treatment. Uh, it is difficult, but we make it look easy. Uh, creating the perfect smile, we go through the process of knowing you as a person, your character, your personality. Um, we take all of this in account and uh, to create the perfect smile just for you. And what's amazing is they come in the morning, get sedated. By the end of the day, they leave with a brand new smile. And that easy. Awesome. <laughs> Brand new smile by the end of the day. And Dr. Menares, you have some examples to show us today of uh, how you change these patients' lives. Exactly. The first lady had every tooth in her mouth, root canal treated with crowns, and, and she spent a lot of time and money in the dental chair. She did the right things, right? And 
and she was in, in with dental issues again. Everything was failing again. So she came to the office and rather than putting another Band-Aid, uh, we decided to redo her mouth and replace her teeth with dental implants with the all on four, top and bottom, while she was sleeping and this is how she looks now. In this case, because we replaced all of her teeth, uh, we were able to design and create the smile according to her facial features. And she looks amazing, beautiful, healthier, and happier. The next case is a, it's a wonderful man, you know, good-hearted human being. He did everything right. He, he went to the dentist, he took care of himself, and he still had problems with his teeth. So he came to the office and we offered him a different type of solution. He replaced his teeth with implants, and, and this is him now. He is just a beautiful soul. We love him. Uh, we created and designed his smile. He's delighted with the result and he's happy. All right, Yesenia and Dr. Menares, thank you so much for your thank time. You so much. If you're looking to change your life today, the first 10 people to call will get the Love Your Smile offer with a complete smile consultation for free. That's $350 in savings. Just call 210-864-9622. And for more information, visit ImplantSanAntonio.com. Tomorrow on SA Live, global chocolate flavors right here in San Antonio. How a local chocolate maker is bringing you sweet flavors from around the world and how he's taking the business to the next level. Check this out, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Marvel Super Heroes versus Street Fighter, even Mortal Kombat is back there in Street Fighter 2. We're gonna take you to the Kung Fu Saloon where you can enjoy classic arcade games and some cocktails and make a big impact on friends and family right when they walk through your front door. We're showing you how to elevate your entryway tomorrow at 1 p.m. on SA Live. All right, earlier we asked you to age yourself by naming the first concert you ever attended. Ooh. Lydia says ZZ Top oh. in 1974 with Santana, Joe Cocker, America, and Austin at, I didn't see where. Nice.